get ready with your peas, man. You know, you pine and just watch us. Okay. They get aggressive. You know? Should we act like we're just taking pictures? I don't want to be on my knees. They're crossing right now at the river, guys. Hola. What you doing? Where are you from? Guatemala? Huh? Huh? Where? Huh? Honduras? Vamos a buscar para otro lado. Where? Honduras? Guatemala? Guatemala? And go to the crossing, please. Get out of the truck, go to the crossing. They're coming. El Salvador? Where was it? Go way up there. From El Salvador? Okay. Guatemala? Honduras? Para... Mexico? Mexico? Uh -huh. For Mexico? No. No? Mm -hmm. Where are you coming from? Where are you coming from? <laughs> I'm just at an A, yeah. Jeremy. I don't know. <laughs> uh -huh. Nino. Nino. You getting pics? You getting pics? They're running from us. Following. This is why we need Patriots at this border, guys. Go back up the way we normally come out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not chasing them through the little light, but it'll crack me upside the head with a rock. Oh my. I'll catch them on the other side, guys. Where the hell did Mike go? We need to go back out this way. I mean, you can get through that way, but it's way too wooded. This way, this way, this way. <coughs> Took off running. Come on, Jeremy.
I'm missing the good stuff. Careful, Jeremy, it's steep. Can you ask them how much they paid to get here? They didn't. Okay. Where are they from? Guatemala. How did they know to come this route? Who dropped them no, off? No one. No. No one. No one told them. They just crossed. Who dropped them off? Because we saw them get out of the car. Oh, they were drinking there, those people. Oh, okay. okay. So were they in one vehicle? One? No, they weren't in any. They, they just walked on the highway? Yeah. Really? I don't believe that. Uh, okay. okay. And they walked from where though, dear? Well, I mean, uh, oh, he's holding that child, guys. Look at that. That's not normal. That's not normal. No, no, that's not normal. They don't know the names of where they came from this oh. morning. Yeah. They've just been, it's taken them 13, Look at that, guys. Days. Look at that. Yes. That's not normal. That is not normal. That is not normal. Oh, they don't know. Really? They don't know the names. They don't know anywhere. They don't know Really? They've been walking? Mm -hmm. Walking? Really? Yeah. Okay. Holy cow. So, did they bring their papers? Look at that, guys. That's not normal. Yeah, they got their papers. Oh, okay. So, the, they get a humanitarian visa from Mexico? That's not normal. Fathers don't hold their children like that. And why are they here? small ranches and uh, there's no work and they need to they're looking for a way to be able to provide for their children so where in Guatemala what, what? Oh, and, and ¿Qué pueblo en Guatemala? <laughs> and what happens when they get denied asylum? He's been around the Do world. Do they have a lot. family in in America? No, ustedes no tienen familia en los Estados. Sí, yo tengo mi esposo. Oh, sí. Uh -huh. Está mi esposo. Okay, en sabe en qué pueblo? En Miami. Oh, okay. She's got a husband in Miami. Oh. So. ¿Cuánto tiempo ha estado en México? Help me. Jeremy. Okay, luego él les dijo que para tratar de que muchas necesidades. Y él los va a va a tratar de que no hay nada. Ajá. Entonces ustedes todavía quieren seguir para Miami. Kind of breaks my heart at the same time. Para allá en Florida, Miami o Arizona, Miami. No, no, no. Florida. Florida. Sí, Miami. 
Florida o Ma Miami. Está su número si quieren. Su número no, 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 no. Nomás le preguntaba. Es porque hay dos. Por eso le pregunté. Hay uno allá en Florida y hay uno aquí en Arizona. Yo ni sabía eso. Ajá. No, Miami y Florida. Ok, Florida. Okay. Es so, que... Converse. Estos son todos sus hijos. No, 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 este es... Ok. Este es. Okay. okay, that's your boy, el niño? Mm. Sí, ok. ¿Nombre? ¿Se llama? Ricardo Rosales. Ricardo. Ajá. Okay. Is... Saben Isaí. ¿Asaí? Isaí. Ok, Isaí. Ajá. ¿Tu nombre? Gucci, he's Gucci. No. <laughs> ¿Qué es tu nombre? <laughs> ¿Cómo? Clement. 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 Ok. Ah. Clement. ¿Y tú? ¿Cómo te llamas? Diego. Diego. Ay, qué bonito. He's gonna go get him water. Coming to Florida, you heard that, guys. <coughs> so I'm curious. Were they promised anything in America? Uh, they're, they're, they want to reach. Florida, so they can unite. What well, she does, so she can unite with her husband. Okay. How okay. do they all know each other? Oh, como, como se juntaron todos ustedes. Se conocían? No. Se encontraron en los caminos. Todos. Okay. They they met each other on on their trip. Wow. So they decided to just come together. Okay. And how do they plan on taking care of themselves once they're in Florida? Yep. Since they can't legally work. Um. <laughs> Little late to the party, bud. We found you some work. Is that another body over there? No. Uh, no. That's ours. He was going to go get him water. Because they're all thirsty. Oh, there they go. We are not aiding a betting. Mira, señora, aquí. Aquí adentro. Por favor. Okay. Thank you. So you heard it, guys. So these folks will be bussed into Back Phoenix the first. Is there any more coming? Do you know? He doesn't know. He doesn't know. Quiet down, Brandon. How's, how's he gonna know? Right. So these folks will be uh, bussed over to Phoenix. Adios. And, uh, Adios. and then they're gonna be, uh, the church in Phoenix will provide transportation to get them to Florida. That's how it works. So they get from here, they go to Border Patrol Station. They're processed. Don't we have seatbelt laws? They don't have to apply, abide by any of our laws. They're just going to pack. No, this guy is. We don't want to irritate him anymore. Right, right, right. So they're going to go um, down. Can I get it? Okay, never mind. And there they go, guys. All they got to do is climb that river. See, and they're in America. Are you happy that I talked to you into yes. staying for a bit? Yes. You want to go back down? Yes. Could be some more. Come on, let's go. You guys want to go back down to the river? I'm going back down. I'm going back down the river. It's a little scary at first because mm -hmm. you don't know what's gonna come out the other they side of the tree. She was so scared. Hold my gimbal scared. while I while I okay. border hop here. See, but Up on the border. Yeah. So they had. They said they had nobody. Nobody. They just found it. They, yeah. they, right. I don't believe that at no all. Water had, I don't believe that at all, guys. There's no way they just found this spot. No. No. Dude, there's no way. They paid somebody and they got through. They're not going to admit that. Yeah. There's no way they knew about that spot. And they were just walking down the highway. Well they Absolutely. Need. They've been very, very the welcome. Way we'll go around and dip down in okay. these I know. I got lost there for a minute. And then I was like, shit, I'm not going to chase them, you know, blindly and get 
cracked okay. upside the head with a rock. Put that in the truck. Yeah. Okay. All right, guys, we're going back down the river. We're going back out. Just for a few minutes. Share this out, guys. Share, share, share. Follow this page. Follow this page. You stay in, Germ? Yeah. Girl Scout. <laughs> Girl Scout. We need our Spanish speaker, though. Well, <laughs> Jeremy, where are you from? Oh, <laughs> so dear. Yes, you did. He's a from. -a. Where are you from? -a? <laughs> I'm going to tell you to walk up here because invariably they're going to come out right there. Yes. That's where 99% come out. So okay. just take a trip up either. Yeah, they right, got freaked out when they saw me. And I was like, oh no. I know. Yeah. <laughs> we want to hear their stories. Right. I want to yeah. know who they've paid. They're not going to give it up though. No. Just ask them the process. Maybe they'll give it up. Right. We don't know. Stop. All right, let's go. Let's go. I have like 30 more minutes. I gotta go home. My family's gonna kill me. This is like a full time job. <laughs> okay. The rule is don't go down through that way. No, that's where I got stuck. And then you can't see like what's on the other side of the tree, so I didn't trust it. You that's know. Why I bolted this way and right. came around this well, way because right. I knew that they were. And then she got separated from the rest of them, so she was kind of panicked. And that just leads for a bad situation. Okay guys, so again, border fence. We are on the US side. The other side of that fence is the border wall or the border road. Yeah. Well you hear him sloshing through that river. I was down there just looking around, and then I heard. No, I saw the top of the I know, I saw them, they didn't see me. So this time, since we don't have so many people, yeah. let's, just get, let's just get right down on that one level. Yes, yes, yes. So we can see it. By the river? Right the river. Yes. Yeah. yeah, because you're out of view, too. Yeah. You're out of sight, and it's, and it's shady up. But I don't have reception down there. Huh? I don't have a signal down there. That's the only problem. We'll just record. How about I got a live stream going? I got 438 people watching this. Oh, okay. I don't want to kill it. Hello. Hello. All right, guys. Stay with us. We're going back down to the river. This is the main crossing spot right here. So there's no way that I buy that they just stumbled upon this area, you know? They weren't giving it up. Smugglers, you know. You know they paid smugglers. In fact, I'm gonna have to go back through my uh, footage from San Luis because when I went to go visit San Luis, San Luis, there was um, hundreds of families sleeping on the sleeping on the other side of the wall, and she looked very, very, very familiar to a lot of those families and they were waiting out there for months guys for months That border patrol agent does not like us here. That other spot was great because you could hear them slushing around before they reach us. So guys, I think the uh, I think the guys riding the dunes up there are like, you know, decoys to make it look like that's what the activity is up there because it was quiet all day and then the uh, the dune riders came and then the migrants came so look we stay on this but we, we can see them right here right but they can see us we need to get behind something well
Yeah, 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 yeah. You can see that road. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're right, you're right. Just where my mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just get behind the tree. Get behind my own tree? Yeah. Just stay still. Okay, gotcha. I'm gonna sit right here. I'm gonna squat down right here. Okay, so guys, check it out. We, um, look at me. <laughs> um, we, hold on, let me turn this down. Gimbal, come down. Um, we hid our trail cams. And I put the trail cams, um, along the water. And, uh, we heard slushing around. And one of the scouts came and stole my trail cam. So we were down at the river and uh, putting up the trail cam and I turn around and there's this man standing on the other side of the river. So he saw us, he saw our location. We walked away for just a few minutes and we turned back around, came back to check it. He stole the trail cam. It's blurred still, come on guys. Doesn't look blurry to me. What? What? How many you got logged in? Um, there's 491 people watching. I mean, you, you saw how fast that went. They literally got dropped off right over there, right on that highway. You can see, let's see. See that road over there? Hold on. It's like a, a little dirt road back there. So they just walk right up, walk into that river right down there. It's the path. The river is in between the bamboo. And in they come. Flag down Border Patrol. And they're in. Guys, they've all been coached. They've all been coached on what to say. Is it still blurry, guys? I'm not. I have. Okay, so. I didn't think it was normal the way that man was holding onto that little girl though, the way, the way he had her um, arm in a grip. That was not normal. I am a hot mess today. What do you mean? Yeah, it's not a super great um, signal, but yeah, they, you know, I am on the international border. So there's no way that I believe that that woman and those two men and all those kids were just wandering around and found this very location that we've been, you know, had our eyes on all month. There's no way. You know, they pay these scouts, or they pay these, these smugglers to get them through here. And they're not going to give up the location or the, the, the information. So the recap is, if you're just logging on, we're here at the, at the border, here at the border in Yuma. This is the... Uh, We're here at the border in Yuma. This is the uh, Grand Central Station of illegal crossings right here. This very spot that I am sitting in right now is the um, 
the mother hub of where all of the illegals are crossing. And parallel to that border is Highway 2. Yeah, guys, I already wiped with baby wipes. I was climbing trees and hanging my trail cams and, and digging and and I'm, I'm a tomboy, it's how I roll, I don't care that I'm filthy dirty. Um, so, yeah, we're here in Yuma, and uh, this is Grand Central Station where they cross. The highway runs parallel to the river, so the river is actually the, uh, come on, gimbal. The river is actually the actual border. So all they have to do is travel on that highway with a smuggler who gets them up to this very spot, drops them off, and they just walk, I'd say maybe, maybe a hundred yards, if that, and they're, they're across the river. The river is um, only knee deep, and that whole family with those little ones all cross that river and ran into our country and nobody can stop them they've clearly been coached on what they need to say to get across um, they know the game they know the loopholes they know if they have those children with them they're gonna get across now maybe that woman maybe those children did belong to her but I'm gonna guess that that man gripping that little girl's by her um, bicep was not her father for one he looked very young himself and for two um, I, I, fathers just don't hold their children like that that was just very odd to me um, very unnatural very um, aggressive um, so we know we've been in Mexico we know that children are bought sold and uh, trafficked with these men to get through uh, I think Kirsten Nielsen, Secretary Nielsen, just released that report that uh, I think there was like 300 children that were just caught. Um, were, uh, they were either unaccompanied minors, somebody refreshed my memory, it's been a long day and it's really hot out here, my brain is just fried. Um, or they didn't belong to the, to the adults that they were with. So, you know, th they are using these children to gain entry into our country. And um, it's just sickening. It's sickening. When we were in Tijuana, right after we left those migrant shelters, there was a child that was kidnapped from the shelter um, to be used to, to gain entry. And, you know, they were also, if you follow Oscar Blue, they were also uh, busted arranging fake marriages in Tijuana. So let's say, you know, I have a child and I have a decent record, but you're an MS-13 member, let's marry us. That way, if I get in and claim asylum, you, the MS-13 member, can automatically come in with me. So, you know, that's the, uh, that's the loophole. The loophole is, if you have a kid in tow, you have, that kid is a passport. That kid is your guaranteed um, ticket in, into our country. And so, like, my question was, how are you going to take care of yourself? How do you plan on taking care of all these children? They, they legally can't work until they, until they, you know, technically have asylum or they've been granted asylum. So, you know, what, what, how are they going to take care of themselves? Nobody knows. And there's all kinds of disgusting things over here. So, you know, I don't know what, what they do. That's why, I want to, that's why I set up the trail camps, guys. Because I want to know what they're doing over here in this area right after they cross. So what happens is they cross the river and we found um, birth certificates, IDs. We found um, all kinds of pills uh, like Dramamines and uh, Benadryl and like uh, like drowsy medication. So my, my thought is, you know, are they drugging these kids? That's what I'm thinking. And so, you know, we set the trail cams because I, I want to see... Why are they dumping all of their, all of their documentation? Why are they dumping all of their items that they don't want Border Patrol to find on them? So, hopefully, hopefully the trail cams will pan out and uh, we'll be able to get some good footage on there. We were kind of screwing around with them all day today, trying to get them to work. 
Okay, so, you know, it's only one little family so far today. I gotta get home. Alright, let's see what's going on in here. I stepped on my glasses, so they're all crooked. I think that might be it for today. What do you think? No? <laughs> <laughs> as long as there's daylight. As long as there's daylight, huh? This is the kind of mission <clears throat> that I really believe. This reminds me of being in Vietnam. Yeah. Okay? You got a similar thing like this. You, you just have to be patient. Right. And there's no trail camera right. that's going to give you the right. senses that, that you get. Right. You see? The hearing, the peripheral vision... The looking out, the spotting things. Right, I mean, right, it right. just, it's, but you know, patience. Where did they come patience from? Patience is because a virtue. All I saw them On the top. There. Yeah, I know. Huh? But where? Did they come from the top, top? Or did they? That's a good question. Where did they originate? Right. Somebody for sure told them, them where off. the drop off right. was. Right. And, you know, I don't I, believe for a second that walk, they just found this how spot. How do you walk to San Luis? It's you know twenty something miles. That's what I'm saying. Their feet, they didn't look like right. they walked. No, and, and those then kids had walk, how would they know? Oh, let's come to this tree. Right. And there's this path. Exactly. Yeah, I know. No. They've been. They've been coached. They've been well coached by somebody, as to what to say. But this time, I didn't see anybody back behind. Scouting. Them. They just said, here you go, right, see ya, right. on the road. Right, right. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, guys, um, I don't want to go down there because I'll lose my signal, but... Really? You lose your signal? Yeah, cause maybe because it's just so low. I don't know. Oh, here. What's the next one? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. You see your regulars on? Mm -hmm. I can't tell. Oh. I got my Signal. green on. Signal they said good. we need camo on. What was that? These are ducks. Maybe. It's a quiet day today, though. Yeah, relatively quiet. Like, not like that one day when it was just, like, huge groups. I think tomorrow's going to be slammed. Tomorrow's... Yeah. And all the feet prints, too, guys. So this is the little path down. I got stuck in the sand trying to come up that side. See, you have a better look over here. Maybe kind of. Okay, see that dirt road right over there? I'm going to drop down here. You going down? Okay. Damn birds. So, yeah, guys, just, you know, feet prints for as far back as the eyes can see. And there's the river. Can't see it through the bamboo. And if I go down, I'll lose my signal. But yeah, I mean, that's where they're coming from, right up there. There's absolutely nothing preventing them from walking into our country. So yeah, I mean, it's just a wait, a wait and watch game. There's, you know, no way to predict this, but 
You know, and of course they leave all their garbage out here. There's all kinds of like, that's, you know, a somewhat fresh bottle too, so. And that's a very fresh um, piece of toilet tissue. Look at all these beet prints up here. See all that, guys? This is, I mean, this is the mother trail coming in. They have two, two options. So they come up from, see where Mike is right there? You have signal? So that's the uh, crossing right there. Mike's going to show you. See where the river is right there? It's easier when I have a body standing there. You can see the water back there, right? So that river is actually the the actual border boundary. So what Border Patrol, come on, Gimbal. Come on, Gimbal. What Border Patrol told us was that if we go down to the river, we can walk in the river, but if we put our feet on the other side of the river, then we are officially crossed into Mexico. And it's against the law, so can't do that. But they can come this way, right? So uh, yeah, Mike's down there watching, listening. my signal down there um, yeah so watch look at this trail right here Ooh, it's really hard to walk in the sand too. Gimbal. okay so there's first trail from the river and then from there and like this whole desert is just littered with like maxi pads and tissues and socks and water bottles and just garbage. Get down so I'm not so visible. Get behind the tree. But yeah, guys, look at, look at, look at, look at, look at. Look at that. Look at that. It's just a major thoroughfare. Right up here. Major thoroughfare. Come in. It can either go up that way. And over. And then right back on that side is the, the bents. Look at my hands, guys. Jen is a tomboy to the fullest. Found a cell phone, too. guys I think I'm gonna log this off I gotta start getting back home that one little bit of action that I they usually come after five I've noticed 
I don't know why. Yeah, son of a bitch stole my trail cam. Strung it up on the side of the river right there. And he came down and he waited and he waited until we walked away and then he crossed the river and stole my cam. Recap, we're just chilling over here at the border, watching, documenting. Sun's starting to go down. I think we're gonna call it a night. It was a really super slow day in this area right here, but last week that happened too on Saturday and then they got like hundreds the next day. Yeah, isn't it funny? That Border Patrol does not like us at all. It's, you know, they're all kind of different. Which, you know, you would imagine. But uh, he does not like us at all. Wants us out of here. The other guys were cool. You know, but we were able to stop him and hold him until he showed up, at least. I mean, they didn't just waltz right into Yuma. So, okay, so I'm going to keep this, I'm going to shut this off, and then, you know, some action's going to pop off, it's how it goes, but. All right, I got to get going. I think I got to go. Or we walk out and act like we're leaving and wait further out in case they're watching us right here. It's be a quiet day for smuggling. Just the last minute. Okay. Last minute. Okay. Break. We're gonna go back and launch the drone just to get a last look. Whoa. Unless you want to leave it till tomorrow. No. Yeah, bring it back tomorrow. I'm getting in a better spot. Yeah, I fastened it pretty good. Yeah, you guys think there was more? It's hard to tell. You know, I wish we could predict it, but we can't. My phone's gonna die anyway. Just never know, you know?
ってね。Alright, guys, we're out of here. Let's go. Or stole my trail cam. Trail <laughs> I didn't even have it out for an hour. <laughs> I didn't even have it out for an hour. <laughs> Alright, guys. Over and out. Over and out. Over and out. <laughs>